Good morning and thank you for joining us. I'm Brianna Malloy. The holidays are meant to be a time of joy, but for some it can be one of the most difficult times of the year, especially when it comes to our finances. In response to this, many food banks are trying to lessen the burden. 25 News reporter Bain Froney joins us in studio with more on how you can help. Bain, good morning. Good morning, Brianna. That's right. Now, Christmas and New Year's are meant to be a time of celebration, but for a lot of people in our community, their main focus is just being able to put food on the table. And it can be even harder during the holidays, which is why food pantries need her help. While families prepare for Christmas dinner, many in our community are struggling to even put food on the table. But what we don't always mention is that's the end of the month. And so for people who are in the SNAP program and people who are on limited income, that means the end of their budget time. Food banks across our community are stocking up for those in need as the holiday tends to be a time where more people utilize their services. Families, they utilize our services during this time of year just to free up some extra income to pay off maybe their electricity bill that's a little bit higher than normal or even to be able to provide a holiday meal for their family. And this year, food banks need help from the community now more than ever as COVID-19 impacted many jobs as well as the food supply chain, causing some empty shelves. We've definitely seen a decline in some of our um, supply chain, especially with the variety of produce or even in some of our meat that we normally have around the holiday season. Caritas serves almost 200 families in the Waco area, helping them keep food on the table. We need the support of our community showing up, whether it's monetary donations or even doing food drives for us so that we can continue to provide for them. Caritas will have their services continue for the rest of the week for those in need of food for the holiday. And the Salvation Army will be providing a Christmas meal for anyone in the community. You don't have to be homeless. You don't have to be anything. Just come. If you're alone, if you want company, if you just want to take out and you can't just manage your food bill that to, to manage a meal that you really would like to have or go out, stop at the Salvation Army. And with your help, they can make sure that no one goes hungry this holiday. And if you'd like to help out your local food bank, they accept both monetary and food donations. Just visit their websites for more information. And I know this is the season of giving, right? But how can people give even after Christmas is over? Well, you know, it's super important to continue to give and, you know, even do food drives after the holidays because obviously they're still in need. But also volunteering is a great way to help out as well. Great. Thank you so much, Ben.